how to solve problems on combination of lens question an object is placed at a distance of 10 cm to the left on the axis of a convex lens A of focal length 20 cm. A second convex lens B of focal length 10 cm is placed coaxially to the right of the lens A at a distance of 10 cm from A. Find the position of final image and its magnification and draw the ray diagram. Solution we are given that there is a convex lens A and an object is placed coaxially on its axis at a distance 10 cm from A. This gives us the position of object. Also to the right side of the lens A, another convex lens B is placed at distance of 10 cm from lens A. We are required to find the position of final image which is formed after two successive refraction from these two lenses. For first refraction at lens A, position of object U is equal to minus 10 cm and focal length of A is plus 20 cm because it is a converging lens. Then by lens formula we can write 1 by V minus 1 by U is equal to 1 by F. On substituting the values of U and F, we get 1 by V plus 1 by 10 equal to 1 by 20. Solving this gives the value of V equal to minus 20 cm. This means that the light which is incident on the lens A from the object gets refracted in such a way that image is produced at a distance of 10 cm behind the object which is also 20 cm away from the lens A. This will be the first image I1 which means that the light will be refracted in such a manner that for lens B it appears to be coming from this position I1 and this will be the first image produced by lens A which is virtual in nature. For second refraction of lens B, the value of U is minus 30 cm and focal length is plus 10 cm. My lens formula we can write 1 by V minus 1 by U is equal to 1 by F. On substituting the values of U and F, we get 1 by V plus 1 by 30 equal to 1 by 10. On simplifying, we get the value of V equal to plus 15 centimeter. Therefore, the final image is produced at a distance of 15 cm to right side of lens B and 25 cm from lens A. Nature of image is real and inverted. In the second part of the question, we have to find magnification of combination of lenses. The magnification of lens A is given as V1 divided by U1. Here V1 is 20 and U1 is 10. Therefore, the magnification of lens AM1 is equal to 2. For lens B, magnification M2 is equal to V2 by U2. Here V2 is 15 and U2 is 30. So M2 will be 15 by 30 that is 1 by 2. So overall magnification can be written as M1 into M2. On substituting the values we get M equal to 1. This means the size of image is exactly same as that of object because the overall magnification is 1. Using this information we can draw the ray diagram. Please like, share and comment on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more interesting and educational videos to earn while you learn, download Extra Class app from Google Play Store and get rewarded for studying.